Hi, it's Doc and Skip, brought to you by American Pride Roasters at AmericanPrideRoasters.com. Burning Man has become infested with gross, disease-riddled vermin. They also have a lot of bugs there. Skip Lacombe has done extensive research on burning men and bugs. What is Burning Man? Burning Man is a multi-day music and arts festival held in the Nevada desert. It's an annual meeting place of 100,000 reprobates that go out and do drugs in the desert. It sounds great, other than the bugs, the drugs, the reprobates, and the desert. I... They burn easily. But now, this year, they've been infested by millions of bugs, and they have no idea why. I mean, I'm sure it has to do with the smell. And over the years, they've trained the bugs where to be. Is it possible that the bugs are just looking for Molly? That's a drug reference, by the way. Yeah, extensive research on drugs, too. A gun range in Oklahoma has been making a lot of news recently. Now, this is one of those gun ranges that put up one of those Muslim-free zones in their store. Okay, I see what they're doing. They're worried about ISIS. Uh-huh. Gotcha. Okay. Now, the owners of this gun shop have been getting death threats since they put this sign up, so a lot of the men in the area have come to guard the business during all hours. Getting death threats from ISIS. I see what's going on. They don't like it. They're giving them death threats. Now, one of these freedom fighters that was going out there helping to defend this business yesterday accidentally shot himself. Police seem to be a little on the fence with this story as some of the people who've been going there to protect this business clearly don't have any gun safety training. Many of them were holding the guns with their hands on the triggers. In fact, he even said, it's like the clappets have come out. Well, good news, we're, we're safe from ISIS. Good, good job. Apparently in America, it's not ISIS so much you have to worry about, it's the idiots. Madame Tussauds Wax Museum in Las Vegas has a new statue of Nicki Minaj, and they're pretty upset because people have been defiling it. Dude, that thing's been defiled for years. The way they have the statue posed lends itself to some inappropriate photo opportunities, so people have been taking these pictures and then posting them on social media. No, I mean defiled time and time again over many years. The official statement from the museum says we've been made aware of the inappropriate photographs involving Nicki Minaj's wax figure. We're talking Drake and Lil Wayne. So they're taking appropriate steps like additional staffers in the area to make sure it will not be defiled again. Dude, we're talking about Meek Mill here too, man. Defiled time and time and again. Thanks to our sponsor, American Pride Roasters. Check them out at AmericanPrideRoasters.com. I mean, there's Lisa Lampanelli, the Nicki Minaj. Make sure to check out our daily radio show. It's at theblaze.com slash doc. We've got that super bass.